Top 1% Pigman here. Let's get right into the mix, baby. Uh, this is, what, my fifth time getting this map today? Great. I'd uh, love to see that. I swear I get this map every single time I play Killer at least, like, five times out of ten. I don't understand why. Excuse me. Hold this. Sweet. Okay, right off rip. We're making stuff happen. Let's get on that. Alright, let's just pursue that, man. Let's just pursue that. Okay, nice little pre-drop. Gen already done. I, we literally just loaded in here, and that's a gen already gone. Love to see it. Cool. Uh, let's go ahead and get some of these pallets out the way while we can. I have a feeling they're going to have a really strong early game and a really bad late game. That's just how I'm feeling. Yo, I mean, how many pallets are connected to each other? Goddamn. She's not even playing the pallets. She's just dropping them because they're so used to just dropping pallets actually working that... When a killer doesn't just sit there and break it, they're like, oh, oh what do I do? What, huh? What? Usually that always works. You know what I mean? Okay, hold this. It's gonna break that pallet and get right back into the mix, baby. Her head trap will keep her off a of gen when she gets off the hook for- I mean, yo, uh, uh, dude. We haven't even been in the game for 50 whole seconds, my boy. I mean, shit. Oh, she's right there. I'm not- I'm not even messing around with her. Let's get over here. Yeah, these boys really want to gen rush me. I, at this point- I mean, dude, we're already at three gens. I might as well just put it right back on a hook. I mean, I might as well. Shit. Go ahead and get it there. Nice. No thank you, my boy. Put sloppy on Yui. Hold this. Sweet. Okay. I could try to fake the pickup and see if anyone comes. Oh, wait. She ran away. Okay, cool. That's cool. Let's put her on a skirt hook. Oh, yeah. Somebody came in. Little too late, though, my boy. Little too late. This sweaty-ass team, man. Yo, I'm actually about to violate these boys. I'm not playing today. Y'all want to gen rush me and shit? Say less. Oh, nice. Give me that. They're too confident, bro. They're too cocky for no reason, too. It's like unwarranted cockiness. Or I'll just get her out the game. I don't give a shit. Yeah, let's play this game. You know me. I do not care. Go ahead and drop that. Sweet. Nice. Okay, cool beans. Jump right down here and get you here. Okay, I'll just slug her. That's cool. Y'all boys are far too cocky for my liking, let me tell you. I don't know why y'all came in here with all that cocky shit, but y'all getting punished for it every time. Hold this. Shit. Oh, you want to teabag me? Say less. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What now? What now, huh, my boy? What now? You die. Yeah, in the corner. In the corner like a good little bitch. Give me that. Teabagging me like I didn't just plop my hot balls on your forehead. Hold that. Sweaty knots all over your lips, my boy. Let's get back in here. Since these boys want to rush these gens out, right? Say less. Oh, yeah. Give me that. You, my boy. I'm going for you. Alright. Damn, if my goddamn... FPS didn't drop every time a survivor did any movement. I probably could have like did something there Go ahead, just use superior anatomy on that Hold that I'm better sweet Gotta go ahead and break this They may finish that gen, but it's okay. I put a head trap on her try to get on a skirt hook before they can finish it Oh, of course, there's no skirt hooks around. Why why would there be you know? I mean what why would there be a skirt hook for me to use? Yeah, of course, of course. Yeah, nice Go ahead and hang her here. Go ahead and kick this. Sweet. Mega still injured. That's good. Alright. Sloppy. Getting put to good use. Okay. Mega still up there. Fangman is down here. Um. Yeah. Let's stop her from getting the save. I would like two hooks on that girl. Mega's injured. So she'd be kind of goofy if she did go for the save. Hold this. Sweet. Alright. Let's back her up. Uh. Someone going for the save? Not really. Oh, yes, they are. Sweet. Love to see that. Hold this. Nice. Got the perfect distance on it. Perfect distance. Put a head trap on her. Yui has a head trap. She can't do anything. Pick her up. All right. Let's see if I can get her to this skirt hook right there. That would be great. Oh, you're not wiggling, my boy? What happened to all the cockiness, huh? What happened? I mean, y'all were gen rushing and teabagging. Y'all got the most survivor side of map in the game. What happened? I'm playing pig. No excuses. Hold this. I'm better. Look, boys, you can say what you want, but this is how you play pig right here. This is how you play pig. Probably the weakest killer in the game, but I'm making her look strong right now. So you can say what you want, but I'm just making shit happen. Gotcha, stupid. 
Hold this. Sweet, cool beans. Put your little goofy ass on a skirt hook. Love to see it. Just in case someone was on a gen during that time. Hold that. Sweet. Okay, let's get right back over here. I'm not going to go stealth because it slows me down. And I want them to be afraid of my terror radius. So they'll interrupt the heal. They still got that heal off. I don't know where they went. Oh, she's dead. Cool. Imagine killing yourself on hook against a pig on Borgo, my boy. Yo, that is actually sickening. I broke your spirit with the pig. Ugh. I mean, y'all popped two gens within the first 50 seconds of the game, but y'all want to quit now? What happened? I thought y'all was teabagging this shit. What happened? Keep that same energy. Yeah, keep that same energy when I get focused. You boys need to keep that same energy. I don't know what happened. Yeah, never teabag a rank one pig now. Come on now. Y'all know better than that. Top 1%, baby, undefeated, undisputed. One of the best in the world right here. Come on now. Oh, we're running on the outskirts of the map, are we? Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Looks like I neutered these boys. Y'all were all cocky. What happened? What happened to your balls, my boy? Did I cut them off? What happened? You don't have shit. Fake that window. Hold this. I'm better. You can have another head trap. Hold this. Get that weak shit out my face, bozo. This little goofball really thought, I got you with the flashlight safe. Hold my nutsack. Hold this. Bozo. Shitting me. I'm better. But you knew that already. Little thick booty Meg finna die in the corner. Ah, okay. Nice pre-drop, stupid. Hold this, I'm better. Let me guess, you have another pallet in here? Oh, wait, no, you don't. Hold this, I'm better. Shorty gave me a little smooch. She is smoochy. Meg is a smoochy. Ah, ah, pre-dropping like shit. Oh, you die here. Hatch was back there. Drop that. Why is every pallet on this map the safest pallet in the game? I have to force her that way. Yeah, nice. What the hell just happened, bro? My shit just disconnected? Are you serious? Oh my god, man. My whole shit just disconnected. <laughs> oh, I don't even know where she went. She found Hatch because of that. She found Hatch because my Xbox remote play disconnected, bro. You... <laughs> Oh, man, you can't make my luck up. You know what I mean? Like, you can't even, you can't even write this shit. Like, my luck is so bad, it's, like, I don't even understand how my luck got this bad. Like, at what point in my life did all my luck just decide to be terrible? I don't, I don't understand. But anyways, yeah, this is what they brought. This is the team. They got destroyed, and yeah, that's all there is to it. I play on this. This is what I use to play the game. And, um, yeah, sometimes the app... It just disconnects and I have to reboot it, which is what I had to do in the middle of that last chase before I could get my little juicy four piece. Uh, but yeah, you know, and when it happens, uh, all the buttons on my controller stop working or some of them at least. And I can't hear anything like it does it almost every time I record now. And I've actually lost games because of that. So thank God it happened at the very end of this game. But yeah, you know, sometimes you just have one of those days where everything goes wrong. And you just want to go back to sleep. You know, and those days come around, man. Those days come around. It is what it is. It's to be expected. All you can do is try to be productive. You know what I mean? Despite the shitstorm of bad luck that just, you know, will not leave me alone today. Um, you know. Interesting. Okay, we got some people right off rip. Ooh, wow. Okay, so we've got some cocky boys. Trying to preserve Shack Palette. Cool. Hold this. Yeah, I don't even know how I got spun right there. That was stupid. All right, hold that. Nice. Want to be cocky? Fine. We'll play that game. Hold this. Sweet. Yeah, I don't know if y'all want to be cocky with me, my boy. I really don't know if y'all want to do that shit. So, so we just got a new update. I don't really know what happened, but dude, the survivors have been sweaty as all hell. I mean, god damn. Every single game, surviving with friends, map offerings, da 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 da. You know what I mean? Like, holy shit. And look, I'm here for it, man. I don't mind it. I'll play my little M1 killers and do my little thing. You feel me? I do not mind going against really good teams uh, when I'm in the mood for it. You know, when I'm just like trying to hop on the game and chill a little bit, vibe out. Bro, I'm not going to fall for your little BT bullshit. I know you have base kit. Give me that. I'm better every time. Look at this. 
I'm gonna show you why I'm better. Wait, actually? I catch you, my boy. I catch you, my boy. You don't make that. Don't even try. You don't make that. I reach for those. Hold this on better. Every time. Every time. Every single time. Oh, they got a gen pumping over there, do they? Okay, cool. Let's put you on a little scourge hookaroo. Hold this. Thank you very much. Sweet. Nice. All right. Ooh. Okay, bet. Gotcha, stupid. Oh, yeah. Okay, sweet. Uh, Get a slap on her. That mending, uh, in case she does get away, wouldn't hurt. Sweet, I have superior anatomy, bozo. Oh, yeah. Just gonna give me that. Nice. Oh, I'm getting teabagged? Cool. Someone body blocking me there, or what? That was weird. Okay, that's a gen out the way. Let's go ahead and break this. I have no idea where she went. I think she... Pretty sure she went over here. Oh, yeah, she did. Sweet. Hold this on better. Come on, they don't call me top 1% for no reason now. Come on. Give me that. You boys came in here a little too cocky. Teabagging me and shit. Hold this. Sweet. Alright, they got these gens pumping though. Yes, they do. I don't even want to hear anything about me tunneling because I'm playing pig right now against these sweaty ass survival with friends. Like, don't even. Like, don't even bring that dumb shit up. People that complain about tunneling have never played this game at a high level. And I'll always have that belief. Like, you, you literally don't know what high MMR dead by daylight killer gameplay is. You, you have no idea. It's a foreign concept to you. Because even Ots Darva the other day was complaining about how if survivors can bring brand new parts and do all this shit, then why can't he tunnel? And that expecting him to not tunnel is completely ridiculous. And yeah, I totally agree. Wow, look at that. I'm getting teabag. That's crazy. Gotcha, stupid. Oh, this? Nice. She's trying to bait a hit out of me, but I won't fall for that dumb shit. She's gonna go ahead and give me Shag Pallet, duh. Cool. Once I get her on a hook, it's, uh, it's toast from there for them. Playing pig against Survival with Friends with Made for This is actually, like, brutal. Look at all these safe pallets, dude. You can't even mind game these at all. You literally can't mind game them. And look how many there are. I mean, they had Shaq, then they had the pallet on that tile, then they had the, this pallet right here, then they have the other pallet. It's crazy. Like, what even is this game right now? Shit is insane. And then, beside all that, is main building. <laughs> like, oh, they, oh yeah, a pallet right here as well. I mean, why would there not be? It's insane. And all I can really do is force all the pallets out of them while I can. Because if I don't, they'll just have them later. So I, I don't have any choice but to get all the pallets out there. Hold that. They got this gen pumping, pumping. Yep, they got that shit finished. Yeah, bro. It's literally pallet breaking simulator. That's all this is. Another pallet. Because she has made for this. She can make every single pallet and I simply cannot catch up. Get you here, stupid. Thank you. Yeah, it's insane. It's genuinely insane. One of the few pallets I could actually finally mind game, and she gets absolutely toasted on it. I could have mind game that one back there, but I was trying to rush it to, to stop that gen from popping, but it popped regardless. But yeah, it's actually insane, the state of this game right now, bro. I'm still going to beat this team, though, which is actually hilarious. Because even though they have one gen left, they wasted every pallet on the map except that one right there. Every other pallet and this one right here, all the others are gone. They don't have any pallets at all. But let's get a slap on her. Nice. I'll go right back to the hook. Basically, what I just did is force them to heal. I have sloppy, so it's going to take time to heal. And that's what I want. So I'm going to basically get a second hook out of her. If the other girl goes, there's a high chance that I can grab her or just go for a trade, which would be a trade on a scourge hook, which would be good for me. And yep, this is exactly what I want right here. So cool. All right, she's down. Nice. There's no flashlight to worry about, so go ahead and pick her up, put her on this scourge hook, it's gonna blast the gen, and we just reset everything. Now, the other two can't save, they have to heal each other, and I have sloppy, so it's gonna take some time. That just blasted a gen, so let's try to snowball them a little bit, actually. Oh, yeah. Gotta get on this. Sweet. She has nothing to work with here. At all. Because her friend dropped everything. Nice. 
Except the window attached to shack. Why would there not be? Yep, no pallet here, and no pallet over there either. She has nothing. Bro, are you kidding me? Why would it even do that? You greeted that. Sweet. Alright, go ahead and put this on her. And put her on her hook. Scourge hook here. Nice. Alright, that's regressing. Let's get over here. They stayed in the area, I believe. Oh yeah, up here. Cool. And is this the healthy person? It is. Sweet. Let's actually cut right through here. Okay, cool. Nice. Just what I wanted. Let's use that. Nice try, stupid. You have nothing. And this is what happens when someone just runs around the map and drops every pallet. You can clown on me for the chase being really long. And, oh, he was looping you right there, buddy. He was looping you. Yeah, he also dropped every single pallet on the map. You know what I mean? And now late game, their team has literally nothing to work with. Because they don't have any pallets left. Like, really think about that. You know what I mean? I should have put a head trap on her, but it's whatever. So yeah, I don't care if my first chase is really long, because it's kind of supposed to be. You can finish all the gens you want, do your thing, but at the end of the day, by late game, you're going to have no pallets left. And then I'm just going to snowball you boys. Most people in general think short term. They don't think long term. So they think, oh, just because the first chase was long, whatever, that, uh, look, they're giving up. <laughs> but yeah, they think just because the first chase was long that you're getting toasted and they're better. No, no, I I'm thinking of long term success. You can win the small little battles for the first little half of the game, but what happens when the second half rolls around and you have nothing to work with? I'm not worried about losing the first three small battles as long as I win the war. You see what I'm saying? It's just strategy, my boy. Like, you, you, people don't think of it like that, though. I mean, I do think these pallets are ridiculous and there's way too many, but if I break them all before you guys can finish that last gen, y'all literally don't have anything to work with for the whole rest of the game. So I'm going to win. That's why I wasn't too concerned. You know what I mean? Like, I knew I was going to win. I really feel like it's not rocket science. But I'll get a lot of people in my comments talking about, Oh, yeah, that first chase was whooping you, buddy. Oh. It's like, yeah, okay, and he dropped 50 pallets. What's your point? <laughs> like, what? It, it doesn't take skill to just run pallet to pallet with made for this. You see what I'm saying? Like, Look at this shit. This is the same person that looped me the whole game, right? All right, look. Look what I do to them here. I'll make it look easy. Hold this. I'm better. That easy. That quick. See how they loop when they don't have 500 pallets to run to? That's how it goes. So are they still better than me? I mean, oh, they took me for a, what, a 5 gen chase? Damn near. I mean, what? Are they still better? Hold this. It's actually hilarious. It's hilarious how the DVD community thinks. It's like, they, they can't think long term at all. It's just short term, short term, short term. I don't care if I lose the first three minutes of a 15 minute long game. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I... Get you here. Making it look easy. Hold this. I'm better. This is what happens when you have that one cocky teammate who only thinks about themselves, who can't actually loop, but just runs pallet to pallet. This is what it looks like. Matches like these show skill gaps. Running pallet to pallet and gen rushing doesn't take skill. Okay? Me being able to come back, stay calm, and pull everything together, despite having a very rough first half of the game, that's what actually takes skill. Hold this. But yeah, that's what actually takes skill. Like, I'm playing Pig right now. I have one gen regression perk. What is your excuse? I mean, look what they brought. Look what they brought, and look what I brought. Come on now. There's levels to this shit. I'm telling you, there's levels to this shit. Don't let one long chase where they dropped every pallet on the map fool you. That, that isn't skill. And that's why it frustrates me is they, they, they get caught up in their head. They think it's skill because the chase is long. But I think of it in terms of, okay, the chase may have been long, but I think of it as resources used. You used all your resources in the first chase, my boy. You're not thinking about the team, and you're not thinking long-term. You're thinking of your own ego, and, oh, I'm gonna take the killer on a really long chase. Well, I just took the killer on a 4-gen chase. Okay. And now you have nothing left in the second half of the game. And now, everybody just dies, and I make it look easy. As easy as they made looping me in the start, I made killing them in the end. So, there you go.